Guys, and welcome to my show, and today we have a blood test result, so what are we going to do here? Look at this, boom. So, vegan diets, are they healthy, are they not? I don't know, let's say, so we're going to start just with a quick few uh, white blood cell count over here. So we got polylets, isonophils, uh, and neutrophils. Now, what you think is, oh, you're out of range, you must be sick. And which is funny about the neutrophils is they're low, and neutrophils are present for inviting infection in the body, and mine are low, but what's really funny is I rarely get sick. But why are they so low? Oh, I don't know. Well, if you eat a lot of toxic food, you know, meat and dairy products, this actually would be a lot higher. So, of course, you know, they take these, these stats for maybe a normal human being, if you're an ultra marathon runner, vegan athlete, you're not normal apparently. So, yeah, you got some out of whack readings. Isonophils, a little high. They're um, a few. Uh, if you're allergic to a lot of things, these things will be high. I mean, I have a little food allergies against actual dairy products and stuff, but also the amount of mileage I run causes inflammation, and these cells are, you know, are credited for that inflammation and so they would actually be a little high. Uh, polylymphs, I'm not exactly sure but I think they're similar to neutrophils but now coming over here to this page so from from uh, so we have stats from one year to another and this is last year's test and this is this year so we have glucose in the blood it's 87 this year it was 84 that last year. The normal is 65 to 125. Obviously, right in the middle, and I eat a ton of freaking sugar. Of course, fruit sugar and carbohydrates, so that's perfectly fine. Sodium is good. A little higher this year, which is great. I, you know, made it a made it a, you know, personal thing to get more sodium because I do run low on that sometimes. Potassium, which is really funny, is like I haven't ate, eaten any bananas during this test. From last year, I had more potassium. Um, it was 4.5. Now we're at 4.1. It's a little less, but I've been eating a lot of dates, and dates do have a lot of potassium in it. Of course, that's normal range. Chloride, carbon dioxide on the low side. So my body removes carbon dioxide from the blood pretty efficiently. Next we have my fuzzit Billy Rubin. Of course, liver enzymes, they're going to be high if you run about 150 miles, 180 miles a week. It's just the way it is. When you're a runner, you're a runner. That's the way it goes. So, coronary rest, heart, heart attack stuff. Uh, the cholesterol, I'm 110 overall. Somehow that went down from 138 of last year, and now I'm 110. Maybe the more miles I'm running is just getting lower and lower. I think it should be under 150, say. If they give 200 in America, they're... Their stats are always higher than everywhere else. And I think it should be one under 150. Uh, HDL cholesterol. That's the uh, bad. Uh, that's the uh, good cholesterol. That's 58. Last year I was 46. Uh, bad cholesterol LDL 43. Not too bad. And 72 last year. So wow. I I think I. Uh, did, I'm doing pretty good. Triglycerides. Went from 102 to 45 this year, even lower. So more years on this vegan diet, your blood tests are going to go uh, get better and better. So you know, total vegan. It's been a couple of years now, so they're getting better every year. And plus, I'm running more miles and probably burning more things off. Uh, and then uh, VLDL, that's that other cholesterol, and that went from 20 to 9. So better cholesterol levels this year. They were pretty good last year. They're great this year. And then. You know, all the all these blood cells over here they're normal you know what's also fun about going to the doctors when you're older you get these free little rubber toys you just kind of do this they're kind of gooey and gross but and I just blow them up little balloons they give you they're a lot of fun I don't know where they're so gooey inside but Always trip to the doctor could always be a fun adventure. So know your doctor, know what you're doing, know that you're not normal. If 
you're an athlete and I think you'll be fine in life. So I'm doing fine in my life. Dude, that's huge. Whee! Tune in on the Coyote Loco Show. I meant tune in next time on the Coyote Loco Show. Always inspiring people, and thanks for watching. Uh -huh.